Hey guys, for today we're doing um, a Polish team squad builder and it's a pretty good team and it's really pacey but it doesn't con involve any skillers and that's maybe the biggest problem. Okay, so in goal we'll start off with Szczesny. I don't really like him like in game because he just doesn't feel as good although his stats say he's really good. He just doesn't feel good for an 80 rated goalkeeper, you expect more from him but He's the best you can get, that's from Poland, so he's fine enough. Okay. So, as one of the two center backs, we have Pet Quis. He's, he's not, he's actually the better out of the two center backs. He's got only 54 pace, but you don't feel it because his defending is, only, is 75, which is pretty good, but his heading is just monstrous. He scores every header, like, he just wins every header he throw at him. Okay, and beside him we'll have Wola. Wola, we can't say his name. He's not bad again. He's 76 pace, which kind of pays up for the lack of pace of Pitquis. And But he's only got 68 defending and 64 heading. But he's 6 foot 0, so you don't really care about his heading. Because as long as he's big, you know he'll get it some half the time. Okay, so as a left back, we'll have War Warwishiak Ziniak War War Ziniak. So guys, sorry for butchering this name. Okay, but he's six foot two, which is really good, and got eighty four pace, and he's got lots of strength, and that's really good. And he's also not for a cheap price. Let's say he's one k, but. You can, it's because I did buy now, but you can probably find for cheaper. He's the best you can get for a left back. And he's really good, actually. He feels really concrete. Okay, so as a right back, we'll have Bishesk. He's one of the best people of this, of this team. He's got 86 pace, 80 defending, 74. I mean, all his stats are amazing. I mean, maybe the most let down stat is heading as he's a defender and he's only got 74 but you don't really care because he's a right back and he actually helps a lot in attack and he's really pacey so he actually supports a lot but crease and I actually really like him he's got 80 defending 74 heading 77 passing 86 pace and that's really good okay so as a center defensive mid we'll have Polanski he's I mean, he's not the best player technically, but his def he's really good in defending, and he feels like an extra defender, and sometimes when you need him, he even attacks. His shot feels actually pretty good. I, he feels like he has a pretty nice long shot, and he's got 72 passing, which again isn't really that bad. So, as a right mid, we'll have Dashikowski. He's got 93 pace, which is absolutely crazy, and... He's got 81 dribbling, which feels really, really good. I mean, he's not one of those people which are just pacey but have no ball control. He has everything. He even has a beautiful shot. And as, you, as you'll see in the goals, most of the goal, nice goals are his. And he's a really, really good player. The only maybe letdown is that he doesn't help back in defense a lot. And that's something hard when you've got also Pisesk in defense. Because Pisesk, Pisesk, I don't know how you say his name. He's pretty offensive, to say the truth. But... He's a, he's one of those, but he's always good, and Perquis always stays back, and it's actually not that bad of a defense. Okay, as a left back, a uh, left mid, we'll have Besco of Wolf, Wolverhampton. He's really good, actually. He's got 85 pace, 71 passing, 76 dribbling, and he's really, really good. I actually like him a lot, and he kind of surprised me. And he only costs 2k. So that isn't that much. So I actually say if you're doing an N Power Championships team, use him. Or even if you're doing a Polish team, always use him. Okay, as a CAM, we have Obraniak. He's really good actually. He's got a wonderful shot, I have to say. And he scored three goals, but that's not really what matters. He more sets up the play because he's the one who creates the passes and everything. He's got 81 shot, 84 passing, 80 dribbling. If he was just 4 star tricks, that would make him a whole other dimension, but he's not. 
and also for an inform he only costs he costs very little as it's only 14k so just I advise you to try him out okay so as the two attackers one of them will be Piesh Piek I'm not sure how you say his name he's got 91 pace and 75 heading 72 dribbling and he's actually a pretty nice player it's a bit sweaty of him having 91 pace but if he has 91 pace why not use it I mean you can do long throws his shot isn't that bad actually and his 72 dribbling isn't that bad either okay so behind him we'll have Lewandowski obviously he's he's just beastly 84 dribbling 82 sh pace 75 shooting 82 heading he he scores a lot of goals he scored seven goals in 13 games and that's not counting against my friends so that's again really really good and he's actually one of the best players of this team so guys this is the end of the team uh, but it's a really really good team I advise everyone to use it the only maybe letdowns are back in defense where sometimes you feel there are some extra gaps I mean when the ball is played on the ground they're really really good but once it gets up in the air and they play play it off the ground, you're, you're really screwed because I actually conceded lots of goals through corners and yeah, that's maybe the only letdown. But offensively, Poland is an awesome team and I advise anyone who loves, who loves, it just, when you play with Poland, you get many goals conceded, but you also get many, you score many goals and it's really fun to play with them. So I advise anyone who has some extra cash just to go out and buy this Polish team because it's really really good and this is it for the video I hope you enjoy the goals and bye